Hello again, family. Welcome back to the channel. Thank you guys for coming out and checking out another video. Uh, don't forget, if you haven't done so already, to please like, share, and subscribe. Today we're going to be making a simple ranch sauce or dressing. Let's get it. <clears throat> so to, for this recipe, we're going to be going equal parts mayo, sour cream, or milk. Alright, so to your mixing container, which I'm using a measuring cup because I didn't want to dirty up anything bigger. You're going to add one half cup, so not one and a half, just a half cup of mayo, sour cream, and milk. And it can be buttermilk if you have buttermilk, which will make it a little bit thicker. But we're just going to use regular 1% milk because that's what we had in the house and it's easy. Go ahead and combine those ingredients and mix them together. <clears throat> make sure you get them fully incorporated. Um, this recipe that I made is going to make about a cup and a half, cup and three quarters of ranch. It's good for about two weeks if you keep it refrigerated. Um, as you saw, I did make a mess because I'm clumsy. You know how that goes. Um, go ahead and mix your ingredients together, your wet ingredients. Then from there, you're going to get dry dill weed and you're going to go with about two teaspoons of dry dill weed um, and you're gonna go of course equal parts so you're gonna go two teaspoons of chives uh, or as some people call them green onions uh, but again they're dried and then of course you're gonna go with some dried parsley you got to make sure these ingredients are dry because if you try to use the fresh ones it's not gonna incorporate the parsley is the only one you're not gonna use two teaspoons you're only gonna use one teaspoon of parsley uh, parsley pieces are a lot bigger, so you don't want so much extra parsley in your mix. Now, before we continue, if you guys can go ahead and drop a comment, let me know if you actually prefer ranch or blue cheese. Um, and we're going to keep going. Uh, you're going to add in about a half teaspoon of salt and a full teaspoon of ground black powder a half teaspoon of onion powder and a half teaspoon of garlic powder and you go ahead and mix all that together <clears throat> now when you got that going go ahead and grab you a little mason jar wash out your mason jar get you a lemon you're gonna squeeze just a little bit of lemon juice that that's gonna help give it a little twang flavor for the ranch um, it I didn't even use the entire half a lemon. That's literally, it was maybe, maybe a teaspoon if I measured it, but it would have been too much work to measure it. So let's go a teaspoon of lemon juice if you if we want to get technical. Go ahead and add it to the jar. Go ahead and put it in the fridge. Go ahead and drop a comment and let me know. Do you prefer drums or flats? I don't know. I'm a drum guy. You let me know. Oh, here we go. This was the ranch after being in the fridge for about an hour. Boop, dip. Here comes the money shot. Oh, listen, this actually came out a lot better than any store-bought ranch that I've ever had. Uh, so go ahead and try out the recipe. See how that just looks nice. Go ahead and try out the recipe. Let me know. Just definitely enjoy it. Stay tuned for the next video. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Stay tuned for the next video. This one's actually going to be a little bit different the next one I'm posting. Um, hopefully we can get it out in about a week or so. Thank you.